All right. Now, due to the coronavirus, uh, the, the shipping times have definitely increased. With the low frequency of flights from China to US, and even not just China, China to US, uh, flights all around the world, the frequency has reduced. Right. So this definitely has led to uh, less shipping times because less flights are, are are going. There are less connecting flights. There are less uh, less flights going between countries. So less amount of packages can add, can can be uh, shipped within you know from one country to another. So this has definitely led to longer shipping times. Now, what is the solution? What should you do? There are a couple of things that you guys can make happen. Uh, first, you want to ask yourself that what kind of products do you want to sell or what kind of products you're already selling. Let's say you're selling, um, let's say you're selling mobile phones, just to give an example, okay, or you're selling, um, you're selling glasses, okay, or whatever product you're selling, you know, let's say you're selling folders, to give you an example. So if you're selling a physical product like that, you should send your products to a US fulfillment house. You know, just Google this and just find a US fulfillment company. How these fulfillment companies work is that you send them the you send them these packages, they're gonna stock those packages in their warehouse, they're gonna charge you a fixed fee uh, uh, based on the space that your packages are gonna be taking. You know, maybe it's gonna be based on the weight or the or the or the surface area. It depends. So just find a US fulfillment house, uh, have these products uh, stocked in there. And when you get an order, just share the just share the all the order details with these fulfillment companies, and they're gonna ship these orders for you directly. All right, that's how you can control the shipping times. Uh, the positive thing is your shipping time is, is gonna be a lot better, and your customers are gonna know that they're receiving these uh, these packages from within the United States using USPS. All right. Uh, the downside is that you have to make an investment and stock this money in there. Now, people usually do this, and how, how people usually work about this is this uh, is that they launch something, they know that some product of theirs is, is, theirs is doing really good, they know they can predict that in the next seven days I would be able to make these many sales, or in the next 30 days I would be able to make these many sales. So they buy that quantity in bulk, they save that money, they, they, save, uh, they sa save some money as well because they're buying in bulk. Uh, that that's another money saving and money saved is money earned. They send that um, they send that package. They send those products to US. They are store or whatever country they're they're selling on Canada, Australia, whichever country it is. They stock. They get that product stocked and they get them shipped from that country itself. That's one way. The second way is using print on demand, which is exactly what I do. That's what I preach. That's what I teach. In print on demand, we tie up with fulfillment companies like Printify, Printful. Wherein, um, whenever we get a sale, let's say T-shirts, we, we we sell we sell T-shirts that have something printed on them. You know, uh, we we sell T-shirts that are plain like this one. All right, there's a reason I wore this. <laughs> uh, T-shirts that are plain like this one, and you know the design gets printed and shipped automatically using these US fulfillment companies. That delivery time usually is uh, four to seven days on an average, which is awesome. So, and when you get an order, they print it, they ship it. You don't have to pay them anything in advance. You don't have to buy anything in bulk. It's as simple as that, all right? So that's my recommendation for you, especially if you're starting out or if you're facing issues with the delivery time, just go with something like that. Uh, that's pretty much what you want to do. Do share this video with someone you feel is gonna benefit from it. Tag that person in the comment below. Just share this uh, video with someone in, in DM or inbox, whatever it is, and do let me know how you like this video. And feel free to share what you want to learn in the next set of videos. Looking forward to seeing you in the next one. God bless.